Hi everyone, Anita here. Uh, just a quick video to show you a um, couple of little projects I've been working on. Um, I'm outside, I'm trying not to wake my son up, so I'm out in the veranda, it's a bit dirty. <laughs> We've had a bit of rain and it's a bit of wind, so I've been ditched outside. Um, so this I've made from a little manila folder that I bought from Donna Downey store. Uh, I think it was like a five pack for like a couple of dollars or something um, when I bought some stuff after I did her class in Australia. Um, so this is one of those little um, manila folders which I thought was really cute. So what I've done is I've made a um, based on Amy Tangerine's day book. Um, so it's just a manila folder. So I'm just doing a quick run through of that. So all I've done up the sides is just use some washi tapes, um, some seam binding, um, a few, this is from the Amy Tangerine line, um, I can't remember the, I think it's a sketchbook, and just some scratch, like it's a bit of fancy pants and some craft cardstock, um, so I've just made a bit of a cover, um, I've stitched on my seam binding right across the back with a zigzag stitch, and a little bit at the front. Um, there was a lady on here that did, um, I think it was one of her holiday books, like a little day book, and it was really neat, and her, I'll put the, her name as in here, um, I think it was MC something, anyway, her book was really cool, I liked all the doodling, um, she stitched every page, um, so she inspired this. And I can't remember your name, but thank you. Um, so I'll just open it up. So I've just in here, I've pretty much just used all my scraps. Um, a Polaroid picture. The film um, was expired and the pictures didn't turn out. So I actually just flipped it over and um, used it so I can use it as a photo map. So uh, this one here, she also did as well. She stitched two shipping tags together and stitch them in, looks really neat. Um, There's also some Amy Tangerine paper and I've just added washi tape in places. Um, oh, it's just a typo tag that I'll stick in somewhere. Um, so, and then I've just sort of made some clouds with some pop dots but I didn't realise that I've stitched over top of them. <laughs> I meant to do that. Um, and some more pages, circle page, just some washi tape to reinforce. Um, this really cool camera, this is the Amy Tangerine paper. Um, this was a little paper clip from Typo. Um, oh, in screen neat. Um, and I've just pulled the paper clip off it and just, just like a little chipboard camera. Um, a little Polaroid photo cut out. So that was the paper clip that was behind the camera. I've reused it so I didn't go to waste. Um, used uh, the notepad paper punch. Just stitched the borders of some paper on. Some more washi tape. So pretty much this is just the reverse of those other pages. So I'm thinking about using it. We're going camping this weekend for the long weekend. Um, so I'm thinking about taking some pictures while we're camping and this is really neat um, I've seen a few play people start to use these these are the old viewfinder films that go into the little little click viewfinder things um, so I just printed found a JPEG of that and printed it out as a photo cut out and just used it in here um, and then I've just got a glassine pocket with a tag that I'll probably adhere to the back so that's my little mini day book. And then the next project I've just done was it's this is a little toilet roll mini album. So I'll just come down a bit closer. So I've cut probably a bit off the end of the toilet paper roll just to make it square. Um, flattened and glued them together. And then all I've done is used the white paper out of my album bounding, uh, album inserts, some craft cardstock, some note paper, 
and made what have we got there? four little book signatures and all I did to adhere them was to glue them the covers back to each other um, so then I've just used a little bit of the leftover Amy tangerine um, chevron paper to make covers on the front and back just glued it on put a little title things that make me smile um, and put on some ribbon and just put in little they're pretty sort of Instagram size but I've actually don't own an iPhone so I made these in Photoshop and just printed them out as a 6x4 pay, um, photo I actually fitted six to a sheet so I just printed them out and then um, cut them up so I've just put little doodling around each picture each page washi tape um, tags little flag my little man looks like a little trick with his on his head um, pegs and some little photo tabs that I've made, small washi tape. Um, so yeah, that's just my cute little mini album that I made. Um, didn't take very long. It's just something that you can make that would be a really cute gift for um, a grandmother or a loved one. Um, so yeah, so thanks for watching and I hope the um, noise isn't too much out here. There's a bit of wind, so thank you.